We're making our way to the pool. How you feeling, baby? It's close to there. Huh? It's so close. You feeling okay? <laughs> we got this, mama. Yeah. You alright? I stayed until morning. You stayed until morning? I see that. <laughs> <laughs> you feeling uh, alright? Mm -hmm. On our way to the pool. You got this, baby. Uh. Baby E3 is coming. <laughs> Mommy, Mommy's doing a great job, man. Uh, Baby, I'm so proud of you. Uh, so proud of Us. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna give you our perspective of the big day. Mm -hmm. You wanna hear how it really <laughs> went down? Let's we'll go. give you the truth. Let's do it. Let's find out. Come on. So that walk to the pool. <laughs> Let me tell you, I think everybody knew at that point that it was time. Now we all knew. Um, it's I like knew. I could see out of my peripheral that my midwife Takia and Paula, they were like giving each other the nod. My sister went and put the, the pool to start. And um, at that point, the contractions were getting closer. They were more intense and they were longer. You weren't playing no games. So there was no turning back at this point. So it was she almost like a walk no to the games. electric chair because I just knew what was about to happen. I mean, I and knew it was going to be quick. I knew it was going to be quick. I just knew how intense it was going to be. And I didn't know what to say because I was trying to make jokes. She wasn't laughing. Nah. I at was, that point, I was trying to like sing. There was she ain't want to hear it. I was like, Deval, shut up. I think I might have just looked at you a couple times. Yeah, you didn't have to it. say much. I just right. looked in your eyes and right. I seen, I seen yeah. it. And it was I just was like, just like, let me right, chill back it. here. But it was amazing how everybody just fell in line, though. Like, nobody had to really be told anything at that point. It was like a silent movement of like no, an army. No, I say nothing when you look in your <laughs> eyes. <laughs> it was Yo, just like an army, just like moving. Everybody had their job. It's a certain look that mothers have. And it was have. perfect. Yeah, it was perfect. Everybody the same look like, like when you in the store around Christmas time and you keep asking for that toy and she say no and she say no and then finally she look at you and she just kind of like... <laughs> That's the and look you, just you know had. What time it is. From that walk yeah. all the way back, that's the look you had. I was like, let me just shut up. Exactly. Mm -hmm. uh, So, well, actually, my so wait, my wait. thoughts were um, actually. So I was excited because you know I'm a nurse, so it's like I get to be involved in this. I saw Cairo being born, so I wasn't really nervous. I was just more excited. I was kind of scared for Kadeem because I'm like, girl, like no meds, but you did it with Cairo, so I feel like it should be okay. Mm. I wasn't as positive as you. <laughs> to me, we're in New York City. There's a lot of hospitals all around us right now. There's about three of us, three of them we can go to right now. So I was like, okay, I'm really nervous. I don't know if you should do this. And he's why squeamish, not? so I don't even and know I'm, why he was a part of it. Cause... It just seemed like, you know, a risk. Like, I compared it to skydiving because it's like, it makes sense. It makes How? Because it's like an adventure, but you do not know how it's going to turn out. You don't know what to expect. It can go really good or really bad. But we don't want to look at the negatives. Like, of course, we, we want to look at the positives of the thing. Well, everybody goes skydiving thinking of the positives. All right. And I'm like, yeah. Whatever you need, you just let me know. Okay, so you know, you just let me know. Yeah, yeah, see. Okay. 
Because I know she's back, and I would have to catch her. Yeah. So when you have a contraction, what I want you to try is bring your hips forward, right? Okay. You're gonna hold on there. Mm -hmm. You're gonna bring your hips forward, and you're just gonna roll your hips in the water just like that with the contraction. Okay. okay. Just back and forth, and it can be as violent or as smooth as you want it to be. However way you want, whatever feels good. So rolling it back and forth, and keeping your hips like like you're making a figure eight with your hips. Okay. With your with your body. Okay. Okay. And then let's see how it feels that way. Okay. What you will do is if you're gonna push in this position and your knees will just be open slightly, just like you were in the hospital probably. Okay. Yeah. It was an amazing thing getting in that water. Having not done a water birth before, I didn't understand how much the water takes that pressure off your entire body. Like the you gravity, did. the you feeling and everything. When you got in the yeah, water. it really, really is. So for moms out there that are contemplating a water birth or have never done it before or experimenting or thinking about it, it really, really does. Having had a labor with, you know, no water, natural, mm -hmm. and then, you know, this time with the water. Now, it now, does, you it were does thinking help. about doing it on a bed. I thought about it, yeah, because it's like, you know, you feel like mm. you have more control sometimes if you're like on land, but being in the water, it just felt so natural on at land. that point, yeah. <laughs> to a marine, on land, in the air. You know, on land birth, you know, water birth, <laughs> whatever. So, um. So when the pain hit, now, that shit got that's when everything got, got crazy. I was like, okay, you sure? I can pull up the car right now. <laughs> you want me to show you? You want me to come pull up the car? We can go. It's not too late. No, but like, really though. it was kind of crazy. But then she, yeah, she handled felt... it like a boss. Like she was just kind of like, at one point, she just kind of detached from everybody. She me got too. Into I detached from everybody. You didn't go into labor. <laughs> it was intense though. It was, <laughs> it was. It was very intense. <laughs> But she like detached from everybody. She wasn't listening to nobody. She just was in her zone, yeah. and that was like mad cool. And honestly, that's when we became. Everybody went into their roles. We were just like, all right, you're the cameraman. You're the yeah, like whatever. The doula. I was a doula. You know, I was trying to keep her calm, but devout. Why you call it? Don't make fun. <laughs> Don't make fun. <laughs> the doula. The doula. Oh, okay. Right. I didn't know he was playing cards. Oh. That was an amazing feeling, you know. I mean, the pain still lick. Yeah, but. Pain still, but, but the thing is, though, it but. seemed as if, like, in between each contraction, there was a, a point of relief. There was. Like, there was times was where you just kind of like... Yeah. And then it was just like, you could speak. Yeah, and there was like know? constant movement. You know, Takia was telling me to rock my hips side to side in the water. So always moving, it was just continuing to help the baby just move down and move further down into position. So that was helping as well. Um, so it was a compilation of things, I think, that just made it flow the way it was supposed to. And then finally, I was just so definitely afraid of tearing when I pushed. Mm. So I was like looking to Takia for some sort of like, tell me when to push. And every time I asked her, she was like, follow your body. So how do you like this position compared to the one on your knees? Um, I think I like this one a little bit better just because I feel like it takes the weight off my body a little more. Okay. And I'll do be a little bit more buoyant in the water. Yeah. yeah. back to you right because mm -hmm. this is your process and what your body's feeling so it's not a medical thing i can't tell you where you are you have to tell me what i hear is that at the end of a contraction you do a little bit of a grunt so that tells me that your baby's probably settling down more in the pelvis mm -hmm. and you're probably feeling more pressure right eventually you're going to feel rectal pressure and you're not going to be able to stop that it's okay. gonna feel really intense. It's almost gonna be pushing for you. Right. So that's you remember that, right? Right. I remember so that's what we're looking me. for, right? But right now your baby's sort of settling into the pelvis. Oh. Okay. Yeah, to, it was funny because Taki, <laughs> you had said, you had said, Taki, are you going to tell me when to push? And she was like, no. She was like, no. You're going to tell me when you need to push. I was like, no, you got to tell like, me when to push, girl. I, <laughs> don't, I don't know when to push. But then this. <laughs> <laughs> He's my little son. Oh, no, he no, 
long as he could check in on you every once in a while, then exactly. he's okay. Right. You want to close that door? Yeah. When the pain hit, it yeah. got real. It got into the water, and it was like, you know, mom sprinkled her rose petals. Rose petals and, and the aroma there. It was that romantic. Candles. Yo, my mom. <laughs> She went overboard. Real MVP. But like right looking there. back on it, it actually was really it nice. Worked. It but worked. I would never tell her that because you know she's hyped about that. But it actually it was. It, it turned out. It really was nice. nice. Good job, mom. Yeah, you, you thought I was coughing on the lavender. It was a little. <laughs> we did choke on that pause. <laughs> But she did create her ambiance and everything was beautiful. She did, man. She was throwing rose, she was throwing rose, rose petals, petals in, in it. it. Yeah. Rose petals hit me all in my face. I was like, <laughs> Ma, Ma, enough with the rose petals already. You and weren't she, even in the water, so stop. She was, I wasn't. She was slick with the rose petals though, cause she didn't even let me see the rose petals so they were in there. until until she came over. And this is where she came over. She went over. She went like on the side. Girl. She came back and she was like, <laughs> in one clean release. <laughs> So I kind of addressed Deval, like, Deval is usually like that macho man, you know, has everything under control, true, but like true. seeing him handle with Kay is like a whole different experience. He's like a different person. He's more sensitive. And it's like, you don't want to, yeah. like, it's weird. And he was also trying to distract her, but, but she was I feel like he was trying to distract himself too at the same time because <laughs> it's a really intense thing that's going on it and is. it's happening. It really is. <laughs> so, at one point he was like, hey, like, does this help? She's like, no, no doubt. So shut, she was shut like, down. shut down. Like she was taking control of the situation. Yeah. So he's, oh my God. Oh. So I don't know if we caught this in the vlog, but my <laughs> my mom was being like the ultimate like herself. She was being herself. <laughs> she True. was being herself. True. Like she's a very intense person. She's a boss. She's a director of nursing. So she is used to being yeah. in control of every situation. Yeah. But Deval and Kadeen kind of set the law from beforehand. Like they just kind of wanted to be them and just kind of have that. Especially because it's such an intimate um, experience, Setting, they wanted yeah. to be kind of with them. So at one point, they were like, okay, we need somebody to hold a flashlight. One of the midwives said that. So my mom grabs the flashlight and like holds it in the corner and is waiting. <laughs> waiting. And I'm looking at mom like, mom, you know, you know, you, you know, you got baby yourself, mom. Right. It's not supposed to be in there, mom. Maybe she's there with <laughs> And then she's just like, okay, like, she I fixed think, the blinds. Then she was like, yo, I think I might need a towel. Who first, to, first to get a towel. Mom. Bob. <laughs> mom. You she was like, you know that there. child that wants to stay up late and yeah. is doing everything but quietly? She's like, like sitting so by the stairs, knows. like looking. Everything, everything, I just want to make sure everything's okay. Everything's okay? Okay. 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 And then I was like, Mom, you know, you know you know what they said. And then she was just like, okay, Sakari. And she like walks oh, out. Yeah. And she's so Feeling bad. all bad. So bad. I feel bad for her, but it would have added another it layer was to too the much. whole like, thing. She's just too it was much. already small space. We didn't need too exactly. many people in there. But she was tight. Sorry, Ma. <laughs> Don't be mad. <laughs> you gotta go too. If you go, I go, I go, you go. Watch yourself. I'm not leaving. Sorry. I waited this day out there, Mom. I'm gonna know exactly when it comes out. <laughs> uh, let's talk about how your mother had to be pushed out of the room by your sister. <laughs> Ma, you oh, ain't low. My poor mother. You ain't low, Ma. Low. You tried to sneak in the room. She was. And so Kyle had to tell you <laughs> that you wasn't doing right. You wasn't doing right. You gotta put that into the water. Shine it into is it the water when they're baby. Oh, shine shine merging. Shining it. Oh, Not the whole thing. Shine it. Shine it into the water. Yeah, Ma, don't stick you it in the water. You can do that, Ma. Don't stick it in the water. I'm not supposed to be here. <laughs> <laughs> That's not I'll do it. So you gotta leave? No, listen. See, initially going into it, Deval and I felt like because we didn't know what the baby was, we wanted it to be a moment a where the two of us, yeah, and we wanted the two of us to be like, okay. It's a boy yeah. or it's a girl, and then he can then <clears throat> tell the entire family. So my mother from Jump was expected to be in the room because it's like, why not? She got to right. be there. She was there for Cairo. She was there for... But DeVal missed Cairo, so it was like this Cairo. time around. He's, I was like, you know what? I wanted to just be 
the two of us with the midwife and you know whoever else is there filming. So she was trying to. I find just wanted to be able to surprise to, everybody. To stick around. I wanted to surprise everybody. And she's sitting <laughs> off in the corner. Uh-huh. I think somebody asked for like a flashlight or something, and she yeah, popped out. She popped out the corner trying to hold the flashlight. Uh huh. And I seen out the corner of my eye, but I was so focused on you. I was like, you know, I ain't even going. I ain't even going to go there right now. Let me help you get this baby out. Yeah. And then I heard the cars about some mom, mom. <laughs> Mom, you're not following directions. And then at one point, your brother was in there. And he was just like, Mom, you, you, you got to leave. You don't got to leave, Mom. Why you got to leave? Why, why you got to leave? <laughs> like that. Oh, okay. I'm not leaving, leaving. I'm just so sorry. This is the what? Just have an extra. <laughs> this is for the new baby. Wait, hold on. You don't yeah. want, you don't want, you don't want my... No, we were supposed to surprise everybody with... Like, we're supposed to surprise everybody. And let everybody too. know what... Oh, oh, okay, so yeah, yeah. Oh. Ma, you gotta go. I'm not leaving. No, you gotta, yeah. like, oh, and Brian talking well, about they want me to leave, so yeah. you know, first, first like, of all, oh, let's, let's rewind that. Brian talking about some Ma, Ma, you don't gotta leave. <laughs> Nigga, you ain't having a baby. You gotta leave too. How you gonna tell her she don't gotta leave? You leaving too. Throughout the whole process, I was kind of like the maestro. I was playing music and I was setting the tone and the mood. Adele, Sade, what else yeah, were you playing? Yeah, it was very soothing. I don't remember. Beyonce. Beyonce, yeah. Actually, yeah. funny you bring that up. As Kaz was coming out, which is so crazy to us, because we didn't know what we were having. Right. If it was a boy or girl. Just if I were a boy from Beyonce. Comes on. Comes on as it's happening. It's so So crazy. Sakari kind of nudges me and she's like, do you hear what's playing? I'm like, oh shit. Yeah, like that's I, crazy. I hear what's playing. And, and then Cash at comes that out. moment, he comes out and it's like, and we all see it's a boy. But you're just a boy. <laughs> <laughs> it is not like that. But <laughs> It was like, yeah. you're just a boy. Yeah. It literally <laughs> no. was like that. The boy. And then you just and then saw you're that. Wah, wah. It was like, it was great. It, it literally was. Like, it, it was, was amazing. Emotional. Yeah, it was crazy. To say the least. Mm. As long as you can. Good job, baby. Don't be afraid to push. Good job, baby. Good. Don't be afraid. Hold it. Hold it down. Hold that baby down. Good job, baby. Good job, baby. Hold that push down. Thank you. Oh my god! Hold the tea. 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 Hold the I want you to take and make sure your pushes are nice and long and strong. No, no, you go, baby. Hold your breath. Hold your baby down. That's it. That's it. You go. Listen to me. Listen to me. Listen to me. I want you to hone in on my voice. Listen, baby. Listen, baby. I want you to put gravity down. Push it. 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 Thank <laughs> you. 
There you go. There you go. All I know is that it was the greatest thing to ever see. Yeah. Like, I, I watched Jackson be born in the hospital, mm -hmm. and I remember them taking us, taking him from us immediately after he was born to do whatever it is they do in the hospital. But I remember you also had to get emergency surgery mm -hmm. because um you had you had laceration inside. So you had to get twenty six stitches. I remember how scary that was. But I also remember with Cairo like going to park the car because we had to drive to the hospital and coming back and seeing my baby on the triage table because Kay had just delivered him and he came out that fast. So it was like both situations for us in particular were like kind of, you know, dramatic situations. Yeah, they were you know? frantic, like, ah. But <laughs> with Kaz, as you see, Cairo's laughing in the background, but with Kaz, it was like peaceful and yeah. tranquil and Everything she was, was relaxed. Like, I literally went from birthing him in the pool to him on my chest to stepping yeah. out of the pool onto our bed and we just laid there and it we was slept. Amazing. And it was amazing. Yeah. Pinkies together, like let's catch a little pass. <laughs> I caught Kaz on the way out. As soon as I caught him, I opened up his legs and I was just like, "It's a boy, right?" Because I had told you that I had a feeling it was a boy. So then I put him on K, and Takia was just like, "Oh, you know, you guys have another boy." And I saw the smile on your face. Yeah, because I, I didn't yeah. even hear any of that. I was like, in, still like probably in another world. But I did open his legs to see what it was. And then I heard my sister say, oh my God, do you hear what song is playing? Yeah. The craziest thing. Beyonce. That was kind of eerie. I were a boy. Kind of eerie. That yeah. was totally weird. See, I to thought your Beyonce brother. Be known. I thought you. Beyonce be known. <laughs> Beehive. This wow. Right, dude? Wow, like already? So, That's so, crazy. You want to keep this thing or not? Beyonce comes on, and I thought your brother had planned that because he's oh, he's a DJ. Yeah, 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 yeah. But it, it was like it, it was it. like divine intervention. Did you plan that with him? Because you know you have a way of trying to find out what babies are before they're supposed to be found out. I guess you'll never know. Annoying. 
I didn't know what the baby was. <laughs> she, she gets, she's so easy to get her. I didn't know what the baby was. I didn't know. Right. I know. But that I did hear the song. I heard the song. Yeah. And I was happy it was a boy. Yeah. You know, I'd have been happy if it was a girl, but exactly. I'm happy as it was a boy. Like, like, everyone needs to stop with, oh, I'm so sorry, it's a boy. No, you wanted a girl. Yeah, people apologize. Yeah, too. people apologize. How can you apologize for having a, he- a healthy baby, <laughs> a, know, a right? safe delivery? Like, <laughs> what's there to apologize? And three boys? <laughs> three like, boys, come on yo. now. Like, that, that's pretty winning. I'm pretty, I'm winning right now. Yeah, you winning. Like, winning. We're winning. The queen reigns supreme. You know. Hey, I don't have to share. I don't have to share my throne. She's going to be on top. You know what I'm Being on top is how you got three boys. Oh, <laughs> Lord, clearly. What the bad face? No, I'm trying to put on. I'm not so, he, tried, he, tried, he tried to put on the front. Oh, got two hats here. Man, oh, I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I got this hat. I got this hat. Okay, let's do a countdown. Three, two, one. No, yet? Yeah! I'm going to be the winner. I'm going to be the winner. So throughout Kay's whole pregnancy, I knew it was a boy personally, but I was like in the back of my head, I was like, I hope it's a girl because to see Deval with the baby girl would have been like amazing. And you know, we come from pageant girls, so we are very girly girls. So to have that one girl in the family would have been amazing to dress up with frills and lace and tutus, but. Yeah. When Kaz came out as a boy, it kind of just set the tone. Like, we all just kind of fell into place, and it didn't feel odd. No? Like, it just... It did. I mean, I felt like it was a boy throughout the pregnancy, too. And I was telling Kay, I'm like, I want a girl. And, and he called it with, with I Cairo. I called it with Cairo, too. So yeah, so I was like, I think I'm going to call this one, too, and I'm calling boy. And we all know I wanted a girl just to, for the dynamic, just to see... A little baby girl in the family it brings out a whole different side, you know what I'm saying? Boys, I only make boys, right? Right, fellas? I only make boys, right? I told y'all. I can't believe it. I told y'all. I only make boys. Oh, my God. Told y'all. Oh my God. And, and he's freaking huge. Hold up, hold up. We gotta get this on the snap. Okay, Why did Charlie's head feel so big? He's big and huge. We don't, we don't know yet, but he's Oh, Lord. He got big feet, big hands. Yeah, he's probably the biggest one. He's the biggest one of all of them. Yeah. But I was happy, man. I felt happy to go out and tell everybody we got another boy. I know. That was dope. Everyone was in the hallway waiting. I was expecting everyone to be sitting in the living room kind of relaxing. But nah, no, everybody was, was like, by the door. It was by the door. Wait. <laughs> they were probably waiting to hear our reaction, like if we screamed or something. So that I, heard cool. my, I heard my brother talking about something. All right, now, we hear the baby crying. Let's tell us what it is already. <laughs> He's impatient. Brian is impatient. Your mother, too. Your mother's just like, come on. Come on now. <laughs> she said she come thought on. me heard. she thought she heard me say, hey, buddy. Like when the baby was born, but I don't remember. I don't remember that. that. I don't remember that. Okay. It came out in the water. Yeah. It came out in the water. Really? Was he swimming? Yeah. He was. He was on his Phelps. He got to the end, did a flip turn, boost. <laughs> <laughs> but Kate was. Have the what? Baby Kate. Kate was the way it yeah. wasn't bad at all. Kate was amazing. Real, it was. It was amazing. Kate was real. Real. <laughs> and I'm gonna be honest. I could see her after this cool. experience. Oh my god. Saying. Oh, I won't go for that I can girl. See her saying she's good. Yeah, 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 put the hat on. Put the hat on. Put the hat on. Put the hat on. Champion, champion. You see, you see, you see my yarmulke? You see my light, my light blue yarmulke? Oh, man. That's three. You see my light blue yarmulke? Three's a charm. Son. Sakadi will always be the queen. Yeah, she always. Always so, be the queen. Always be the queen. Kaz came out and it just like. We got another boy. <laughs> we got another boy. And it's never bad to have a boy. That's just a lot of fun. And we, I'm like, poor thing, Kadeen can't even heal. And everybody's like, go back for that girl. It's yeah. like, give her a like, chance, guys. Calm like, down. She calm just down. had this baby. Like, <laughs> let everything heal up properly. Let Kaz have his time to shine. But yeah. that girl is going to come. I think so. I think so. I'm calling it. Are you, are you calling it? I am. Give it like two years. I ain't calling it. Kaye looks stressed out. <laughs> After that baby, I she looked so. done. She so. looked done. <laughs> Do you want to come over and it's say hi to your Jackson? Jackson. You Do you want to go and say hi to your baby brother? Right you can kiss him on his forehead if you want. It's okay. Yeah. He just went in his water, swimming. Yeah, so you can touch him too, whatever you feel comfortable. <laughs> you whatever you want to do. You, you don't just want to got a bath. You don't want to kiss him. <laughs> <laughs>
Yeah. Like he's hasn't left the house yet. He's going to the doctor you on Monday. Don't ask me to do it again. Though. I knew that was coming. See, I was she know me too well. Yeah, because I was he, trying to yeah, was I was trying, trying to put it in like, like you know, that's how you gotta do. You gotta be like, you know, you're amazing, baby, you know. I think you can. Can we have another? This. No. So you done? You don't wanna have no girl? I'm done. Cause you can't guarantee me a girl. That's the thing. If you can guarantee me a girl, maybe I'll entertain the thought. But then what's what, what's what's gonna happen when we got four boys? And that means we gotta go for five. Stay tuned. Don't. <laughs> yes. Hi, Bubba's. Cut it out. Do that. Gracias. Say cheese. Say cheese. Good job, Jax. Say cheese. Wow. Smile, Jaxie. Cass, look right here. When I look back at it, I was like, oh, Even though he didn't get in the water, though, I thought he was going to get in the water, but you know, he was in the corner with his little rum punch. He so he sipped. Me, 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 him, and Brian. Trying to curve that little. <laughs> That edge, take the edge take off. Take the edge off because and it definitely yeah. helped, I guess, because he but he cried a little bit. I don't know if it made him an emotional drunk. That <laughs> might that might have, that might have been that coming it through. It might have been. He shed it a couple tears. Been, yeah, I didn't yeah. get that on camera. I wish I did. You should have. That would have been great. Yeah, because he always see him pretty tough. But. Pretty tough, but he shed a couple yeah. tears. <laughs> Zeus, we saw you. We got you, bro. You're not alone. <laughs> we got you. <laughs> 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 Yo, man, I'm so proud of you. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>